do my job. Everyone else has to work harder, and I, I didn't, didn't want that. Eric Raptosh showed us how challenging it is just to get his leg up off the chair, and how he'll get in and out of bed. The pain is excruciating, but Eric focuses only on his improvement. The 60-year-old was the only survivor of this July plane crash in Truckee, and suffered a broken neck, broken ribs, broken leg, and extensive brain and spinal cord injuries. But even that pales to his personal and tragic loss. Everyone in the plane died, including my husband. So I have things to live for. I, I can live, you know, he can look down and be proud of me. Uh, my friends can be proud of me. My caretakers can be proud of me. Personally, I feel like Eric has, has far exceeded the expectations that I had regarding his head injury and his ability to communicate and have insight into his current condition. Today, Eric publicly thanked the entire staff that helped him on his road to recovery. Nursing and caring for people like me is not for everybody, you know? It's for a very specialized, very compassionate, very empathetic group of people. Eric, a professional photographer, says that he will now go out and look at the world through a whole new lens. I want to go read again. I want to go, go play music. I want to look at the stars. I want to eat strawberries. I want to, you know, just do things that everyone else is doing. And uh, you can do that. You know, there's no limitations. And now Eric will get to do just that. Walter McCullough, KCRA 3 News.